Okay, today we are going to discuss negative and zero exponents. Let's start with the zero exponent. Any non-zero real number raised to the zero power equals 1. So in symbols, for any real number a, given that a is not equal to zero, that is a raised to zero is equal to 1. Now, to, to deepen the understanding, let's have an example. Example number one, we have here C raised to zero. So, since si sira ang na exponent na zero, si sira ang ma equal to one. So, that is seven times one. Seven times one is seven. So, this is the final answer. Now, let's have example number two, which is 10x raised to 4, y raised to 0. Now, in this case, only si y ang nai exponent na 0. 10 here also has an exponent of 1. So, since 1 si 10, dili siya ma-equal to 1. And si y ra ang nai exponent na 0. So, that becomes 10 times x raised to 4 times 1. The answer is 10 x raised to 4. When you multiply this to 1, Moragya po niyang answer. Now, let's have another example. We have here C raised to 4, D raised to 0 over C raised to 0, D raised to 3. Now, since the variables that has exponents of 0, if I see D and C, sila lang po duha ang ma-equal to 1. So, that becomes C raised to 4 times 1 over 1 times d raised to 3. c raised to 4 times 1, that's c raised to 4. 1 times d raised to 3, that's d raised to 3. So, this is the final answer. Now, let's proceed to another example. Let's have another example. Uh, let's say we have e raised to... Let's rewrite this one. Example number 4, we have e raised to negative 4 f raised to 0. In this case, there is negative exponent. Dere na musulod si negative exponent. Now, once there is a negative exponent, you will have 1 over e raised to 4. You will make this variable a denominator making the exponent positive from negative to positive so that becomes 1 over e raised to 4 how about f raised to 0 this one now again any variable or any number raised to 0 that is equal to 1 so the answer is times 1 1 times 1, that is 1 over e raised to 4. So, this is the final answer. Now, to deepen your understanding about this one with the negative exponent, let us now discuss negative exponent. Negative exponent, that is for any real number... number a and any negative integer n that is a raised to n is equal to 1 over raised to n to deepen your understanding with the definition let's have this examples Now, if, if we have m raised to 2 over m raised to 9, now, that is when we use the, what do you call, the sixth law of exponents, which is 1 over when x is less than y. 2 here is our x and y is our and 9 is our y. 
so that becomes 1 over m squared m squared minus no that is 1 raised to 9 minus 2 that because that becomes y minus x so that is m 1 over m raised to 7 if we are going to solve that mano mano that becomes m squared is equivalent to m times m while m raised to 9 that is m times m 9 m's 5 6 7 8 9 if we divide this out we can have this cancelled Ang marbilin dira is 1. So, that is 1 over m raised to kung pila ka book m na bilin. We have here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, that is m raised to 7. So, the answer for this is the same with this one. That is why this is what we are going to follow. Now, let's have another example. Another example is, let's say we have this one. 6 raised to negative 2. Since the exponent is negative 2, when you distribute negative 2 to 6, that becomes 6 raised to negative 2. Since the exponent is negative 2, we need to make it a denominator so that is 1 over 6 squared that is 36 because 6 times 6 is 36 so this is the final answer another example we have here negative 4 uh, raised to negative 3 when you remove the parentheses and distribute the exponent negative 3 that becomes negative 4 raised to negative 3 now since the exponent is negative we will make this as the as the denominator bearing the negative okay dili siya pwede mawala only the negative sa exponent that is why our 3 here is positive now let's solve negative 4 cube that is negative 64 so that is our final answer now let's have another example let's say we have this one r raised to negative 2 times 5 now when you multiply using the law of exponent this 2 that will become ra r raised to negative 10 when r is raised to negative 10 the answer is 1 over r raised to 10 making this negative into this positive so this is now our final answer try to solve the following on your own If ma solve na, you can comment your answers. That's all for today. I hope you learned something.